So ends another exciting adventure of Rexington, Dog of the Yukon! Woof, woof! That Rexington, what a dog. Did you see how he ran across the ice? And how about the way he jumped onto that tree? Attention, Rexington fans! Rexington's favorite dog food is now available to dogs everywhere! It's Mighty Snackies, the dog food eaten by Rexington himself. Yes, Mighty Snackies! Each Snacky is packed with the mighty power Rexington needs to run faster and jump higher! And now your dog can have that same mighty power with Mighty Snackies! Wow, the same mighty power as Rexington. That would be great! They're mighty tasty, too. That's why we say... That dog food must be supercharged. Ah, uh, come on, big guy. It's just dog food. But it's Rexington's dog food. So? 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 We're not just talking about any dog. We're talking about Rexington. I wonder if Mighty Snackies would help me jump as high as Rexington. I bet they would. After all, each Snacky is packed with all the mighty power Rexington needs. Yeah! Yeah! I sure would love to try some Mighty Snackies, guys! Guys? Guys! Hey, look at that! They sure look like they're having fun, don't they? They sure do. Have you ever had that much fun just eating your regular dog food? I haven't had that much fun in my entire life. if our dinners were as fun as that. Mmm. Mighty Snackies, Mighty Snackies, Mighty Snackies, Mighty Snackies. 
Pizza. <laughs> <laughs> Did you ever wonder why Rexington loves his mighty snackies? Well, they're not just packed with mighty power. They're mighty tasty, too. In fact, every snacky is bursting with a fireworks of flavor. So dogs don't just like the taste, they love it. Mighty snackies, mighty snackies, mighty, mighty, mighty snackies. And now back to the polka dance party. A fireworks of flavor. Packed with mighty power. And they're mighty tasty, too. We just have to get some mighty snackies. We just have to. See anything, Cleo? She's coming. Take your positions. Right. Uh, what's my position again? Bark and point. Right. Ready, big guy? Ready. Rexington's new dog food, Clifford? <laughs> okay, boy. I'll ask Mom and Dad. They know how much you like Rexington. I'm sure they'll say yes. <laughs> Here you go, Clifford. Mighty snackies, mighty snackies, mighty, mighty, mighty snackies. A fireworks of flavor! Exactly the same as when I eat regular dog food. Yeah, but this dog food has got a fireworks of flavor. It's really a lot like regular dog food. I don't understand. 
What happened to all the fun that's supposed to happen? The commercial said that eating mighty snackies would help us run fast and jump high, like Rexington. But I don't think it's working on me. Rexington is a pretty amazing dog. Maybe he could already run fast and jump high without the dog food. But still, they made it seem like we would be just like him just by eating his food. I guess no dog food in the world could ever make me exactly like Rexington. Yeah, and I guess that a dog food alone can't really make you feel super happy. So why would they do and say all those things on the commercial? I guess they just think that all that will make us want to buy Rexington's dog food. Well, they were right about that. Emily Elizabeth bought you about two tons of this stuff. Next time we hear an ad like that, maybe we should really think about what it's saying before we get so carried away. So, what are you going to do with all those mighty snackies, Clifford? I don't know. Eat them, I guess. They actually taste okay. Okay. Sounds good. <laughs> Excuse me. Clifford, was that a burp? Uh, maybe. Or maybe it was just a fireworks of flavor. <laughs> really? Nope, it was a burp. <laughs> Clifford! It's story time! You want to hear a speckle story, don't you? Woof! Woof! <laughs> I thought so. He's your favorite. Today's story is Speckle and the Spaghetti Competition. Speckle and his friends were having one of their favorite meals, spaghetti and meatballs. And each of them said that they had the best way in the world to eat it. Speckle showed them how he could eat an entire noodle in just one long slurp. Luna twirled her spaghetti on her fork, creating a tasty noodle twist. Reba and Darnell cut their spaghetti up into little pieces so that they could easily eat it in big, yummy spoonfuls. And Ravi's way was to toss his meatball into the air and catch it in his mouth. As they enjoyed their lunch, Speckle, Ravi, Reba, Darnell, and Luna agreed, any way to eat spaghetti is a good way, especially when you're eating it with friends. The end. That was a great story. Isn't reading fun? <laughs> Problem, hop on. Now, do you see anything? Oh, nothing. Okay, thanks, pal. I'm sure it'll be here soon. my friend Burger. He's coming in on a ferry today. But the ferry won't be here until after lunchtime. I know. I guess I'm just a little excited. He was my very first friend when I was just a little puppy. I can't wait to meet him. What's he like, T-Bone? Well, he's a lot like me. When we were little puppies, we used to do everything together. Whatever I did, Hamburger did. And whatever Hamburger did, I did. <laughs> Bye. 
Burger. <laughs> yeah. T-Bone, hamburger, lunch time. Lunch time! Lunch time! Lunch time! Ready for a nap, T-Bone? There you go, Hamburger. Wilson, I can hardly believe that you and Hamburger are going away. Yep, we're really gonna miss you two. Wow, so that's when you found out that Hamburger was moving away? No, we just thought maybe Hamburger and Deputy Wilson were going away on a vacation or something. When did you figure out they were going away for good? The next day, we were having a great time playing tag in the sheriff's station. You can't tag me if you can't catch me! Then I'm gonna have to catch you! <laughs> hey, Hamburger, where'd you go? Gotcha! Huh? <laughs> hamburger, go on! What's the matter? Are you stuck? No, I can get out. I'm stuck. There! Now you're not stuck anymore. I'm not stuck in the bars anymore, but I am stuck in here. At least until Sheriff Lewis comes and opens the door. Well then, I'll be stuck with you. Thanks, pal. You're welcome, pal. T-Bone, Hamburger! You boys in here? <laughs> you two got yourself stuck again, huh? <laughs> it's gonna be awfully quiet around here when you and Hamburger move away next week, Deputy. <laughs> it sure is. Our two dogs are gonna have a hard time getting used to being without each other. Well. I guess I better get busy and start packing. We hope you'll come back and visit with us now and again. That we'll do, I promise. That's when we finally figured out what was going on. Hamburger was leaving for good. Gosh, that must have been awful. I can't even imagine one of you guys leaving. I really wanted us to stay together, so I made a plan. I decided the thing to do was to pack up and go with Hamburger. <clears throat> Huh? Whoa! Gotcha! Oh, hamburger, go on! So what's going on here, T? I'm packing. I've decided to go with you. Woohoo! Let me help you pack. <laughs> well, that's it. Let's take it over to my house and put it with the rest of the stuff that we're moving. <laughs> I think it's a little too heavy, T-Bone. Uh-huh. I know. Let's get Sheriff Lewis to carry it for us. Then we can help him carry his stuff. Okay. That sounds great. Wait a minute. The Sheriff doesn't have any stuff to carry. Why not? He's not moving. Only Deputy Wilson is moving. But 
I don't want to move if Chef Lewis isn't moving. Hey, how about instead of me moving with you, you stay here with me? Great idea! I'll just stay here. Hooray! You're gonna stay with me! <laughs> Wait a minute. I can't stay here. I want to go where Deputy Wilson is going. Since neither one of us wanted to leave our humans, we realized that our plans wouldn't work. Wow, what a great story. So then what did you do? Hamburger and I came up with another plan. We figured that if he didn't have a suitcase, he wouldn't be able to leave. <laughs> Let me try. Someone brought my suitcase out for me. Oh, thanks, boys. <sighs> well, Deputy, good luck to you. Thanks, Sheriff. Keep in touch. Where's Hamburger? I just have to say goodbye one last time. Huh? <laughs> Gotcha! Oh, Hamburger! Come on! Come on, Hamburger. Time to go. <laughs> I know you're gonna miss Hamburger, and he's gonna miss you too. But don't worry. We'll come back and visit. I promise. <laughs> come on, Hamburger. Let's go, buddy. Bye-bye! <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, T-Bone. I'm sure gonna miss you, but I'll bet we'll both make some new friends real soon. another friend like him. But then, Clifford came to town. Ahem. What am I, Chop Kibble? And, and then, Cleo came to town. And now Hamburger is coming to visit. Gosh. Now I have a whole bunch of great friends. Hey, the fairy is here. Hey, you're right. There it is. There it is. I don't see Hamburger! Where is he? Maybe he didn't come after all. Whoa! <laughs> gotcha! <laughs> Hamburger, go on! Woohoo! <laughs> you see that, Cleo? Those two are going to be friends forever. You said it, pal. <laughs> Friends forever. Are you ready to roll, T-Bone? Ready! Whoa! <laughs> But I'm so dizzy. Oh, look at poor T-Bone. He is so clumsy sometimes. That's not a very nice thing to say, Mac. Being a good friend means thinking about your friend's feelings, even when he's not around. Oh, what a klutz. Please stop making fun of T-Bone, Mac. Oh, but he can't hear me. You wouldn't want T-Bone to make fun of you when you're not around, would you? No, I... I guess not. Did you guys see me rolling? 
Yep. You look like you were really having fun, T-Bone. <laughs> I was. It just feels right when you treat your friends the way you would like to be treated. That's why Clifford's big idea for today is be a good friend. Another exciting adventure of Rexington Dog of the Yukon! Woof, woof. That Rexington, what a dog! Did you see how he ran across the ice? And how about the way he jumped onto that tree? Attention, Rexington fans! Rexington's favorite dog food is now available to dogs everywhere! It's Mighty Snackies, the dog food eaten by Rexington himself! Yes, Mighty Snackies! Each Snacky is packed with the mighty power Rexington needs to run faster and jump higher! And now your dog can have that same mighty power with Mighty Snackies! Wow, the same mighty power as Rexington! That would be great! They're mighty tasty, too. That's why we say... That dog food must be supercharged. Ah, uh, come on, big guy. It's just dog food. But it's Rexington's dog food. So? 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 We're not just talking about any dog. We're talking about Rexington. I wonder if Mighty Snackies would help me jump as high as Rexington. I bet they would. After all, each Snacky is packed with all the mighty power Rexington needs. Yeah. Yeah. I sure would love to 
try some mighty snackies, guys. Guys? Guys! Hey, look at that! They sure look like they're having fun, don't they? They sure do. Have you ever had that much fun just eating your regular dog food? I haven't had that much fun in my entire life. I'd love it if our dinners were as fun as that. Mmm. Mighty snackies, mighty snackies, mighty, 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 <laughs> Did you ever wonder why Rexington loves his mighty snackies? Well, they're not just packed with mighty power, they're mighty tasty, too. In fact, every snacky is bursting with a fireworks of flavor! So dogs don't just like the taste, they love it! Mighty snackies, mighty snackies, mighty, mighty, mighty snackies! And now, back to the polka dance party. A fireworks of flavor. Packed with mighty power. And they're mighty tasty, too. We just have to get some mighty snackies. We just have to. See anything, Cleo? She's coming. Take your positions. Right. Uh, what's my position again? Bark and point. Right. Ready, big guy? Ready. <laughs> Hi, Cleo. Hi, T-Bone. What's going on? Nom, nom, nom. <laughs> That's funny, Clifford. Mmm, nom, 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 nom. Nom, 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 nom. Hey, that's Rexington, dog of the Yukon. Would you like to try some of Rexington's new dog food, Clifford? <laughs> <laughs> okay, boy. I'll ask Mom and Dad. They know how much you like Rexington. I'm sure they'll say yes. Snackies, mighty, 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 A fireworks of flavor! <laughs> Look at me! I'm mighty Debo! Mighty snaggies, mighty snaggies, mighty snaggies, mighty, mighty snaggies.